goes your bike. Yeah, I'm glad he stopped you. Hey, what's up guys? We're out here in Sedona, Arizona, and uh, getting coached through doing the white line. For those of you guys that don't know what this is, it's basically like a really high exposure, high consequence move, where you ride out along this face, you make a turn, you go down the face, and then come back. I don't know, I'm doing it not because I'm getting talked into it or anything, but just because for the past three years, I've really wanted to, and I feel like I have the ability to, and um, I just am scared, so I'm trying to overcome that fear, and uh, I think that's what Victor's doing too. <laughs> yeah. um, so basically, this white line is what we end up riding on, and then, you can see where Simon is out there. So you go out to the edge, and then where those trees are, you end up turning, coming down, and then riding back out this way. Um, yeah, I'm definitely trying to respect this. I know a lot of people have done it, um, and of all various skill levels, so I feel confident in it, but I'm trying to respect it for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, stay high. Uh, I'll show you exactly why you're. Jesus Christ. I'm sorry, cheese and rice. <laughs> oh, Kyle's contemplating. You're yeah, I don't, I don't know. I don't know yet. I'm so scared. Am I too soft? <laughs> the sewing machine leg there. <laughs> you want me to turn around? I'm turning around. <laughs> uh, this is where most people run into issues, right here. Mm -hmm. yeah. The fuck, it gets in the head, mm -hmm. and they just, uh, it's, it's no big deal. So this is where you're supposed to kind of go down, basically kind of where that rock is, and then... I'll see. Just look at the skid marks, though. Yeah. Well, the dog's not scared of heights. No, the dog has more balls than me. It looks pretty intimidating. Again, not doing it for any peer pressure reason or anything, just been scared of it and I want to try to overcome that. But um, at the end of the day, there's no need to push it, but I really want to. So I'm gonna go kind of think about it, see if we can gather some courage and then maybe hit this thing. And I want you to look at the end. Okay. Okay guys, Simon kind of showed me how it's done. Show you guys my heart rate is, you know, 116 and climbing, just standing here. Pretty nervous, but uh, I'm just gonna try to be calm and let's see if we can do this. All right, guys, let's see how it goes. God, that was so scary. I'm sorry to my girlfriend. Sorry to my mom. Sorry to everyone that's ever sponsored me. I love you guys. Oh. Woo! Oh, 120. Woo! All right, you guys, that was the white line. Thank you so Very much, cool, Simon. Man, no, awesome. seriously, that was one of the scariest things I've ever done on a bike. And it's one of those things you have to overcome your fear, but please do not disrespect this line or any lines like this. Simon knows it's life or death out here. And uh, it sounds kind of dramatic, but it really truly is. And thank you so and much, Simon. I was so scared. It, abso it absolutely is dangerous. People that kind of gloss over say it's easy. Yeah. It's not. Yeah, I've done a lot of crazy things in my life on a bike and that was that was scary. So thank you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed watching my fear and uh, can't wait to do some more stuff like this in the future. Cheers.